Hello guys, Pezre here. Okay, so a quick shout out to Seika Madora, A Bomb who looks like he's chilling AFK at the moment, Valkorium who's just run into the actual intro, and also to that little Drickin that's just chilling on the left of the crystal. Now let's get down to Battle of the Builds. Okay, so I'm joined by Tougher Eagle. He's going to take on the Battle of the Builds challenge today. And also, I've decided to come in with a different build, one that I have never tried before. So this is going to be interesting. Tougher Eagle has come in with a build where he's focused his bonus stats on dodge. He wanted a lot of dodge. So let's just sit back, enjoy the video, and see how we both get on. Okay, so if you want to try out Tougher Eagle's build, these are what you're going to need. You will need the Drake Hunter Gold Cloak, Necro Hen Hat, Hardened Shackles, Crimson Staff of Abyss, Furnace Knight Boots, Gifted Armor, Shadowed Plate Shoulders, and the Drake Hunter Belt. So, if you want to try it out, that's what you're going to need. Okay, so Tougher Eagle's time was 3 minutes 16 seconds, point three one. Super quick. I'm very surprised by that, to be fair. Um, so well done to Tougher Eagle for taking that challenge on. And here's his stats on screen. So if you want to give this build a try, just put his armor on and maybe you could jig it and do something with that. So let's move on to the next bit. Okay, so on to this brand new build that I've put together. The only thing that worries me is the defense at 483, but the bonus stats, I'm really liking the look of them. 15, 10, 20, and 20%. So, it's just a case of going in, solo in Rage Valak, and see how I get on. So, sit back and enjoy. Right, so if you would like to try the build that I'm using, you will need the Shadowed Blood Shoulders, Rapid Sash, Necro Hen Hat, Furnace Knight Boots, Furnace Knight Forge, Crimson Staff of Abyss, Furnace Knight Gloves, and lastly, the Gifted Armor. So, if you want to give it a try, or tweak it about, that's what you're going to need.
Okay, so the time was 3 minutes, 4 seconds, point one four. That was super fast. I really, really enjoyed that build. Um, the only downside was I had to spam the pots, but if, as long as you keep on top of them, you should be just fine. It's a very strong build, and I think that's down to the crit and crit power. Um, at 20%, you can't go wrong. So listen, if you're new to this channel, please subscribe, like, and comment. If you've already subbed, thank you so much. And as always, stay safe, guys.